Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we are playing Crystal Guardians. So yeah, this is going to be a pretty interesting game. Don't know too much about it other than obviously it's another roguelike. <laughs> um, it, it, you guys should know by now. Oh my gosh. That music was a lot louder than I expected it to be. Alright. Um, so yeah, this is a roguelike tower defense. It's the main thing that I know about it. Every fifth attack deals... What do I do with this? Um, so we have money in the top up here, okay. Boulder tower, projectile tower... Okay, well, I guess let's just buy a tower. Small, fast projectiles. Okay, so it's a two by two tower. Um, move the camera using, okay, using the arrow keys. It's a uh, camera controls. Okay. Then to build, shift. Two, three. Uh, what does this thing do? Oh, it's just a bomb. Okay. Now I just need to make room for somewhere to put this thing. Can I? Oh, so let's just put a bomb down. Why not? Bad crystal using shortcuts. We can put it on here. So what is in fire rate? Um damage. Damage over time. Uh let's go with that, sure. Um okay. Okay, um, let's go with a boulder, is there any spots that we can actually put it, okay, Q rotates it that way, okay, not really any place to put it, other than, okay, I guess we could put it there, um, okay, and we can speed up time. Does this, does this stuff do anything, or is it just... Okay. Well, let's just, again, buy it for that guy, because why not? That guy got, has quite a big range, which is going to be probably good. All right, we'll do that to him. So then he does area of effect, or not area of effect, but damage over time. He is not very good at leading his shots. At least not properly. Oh, you put it here. So you select the tower. Ah, okay. Well, then let's just buff this guy up. Uh, sure. Okay. He, he gains experience as well. Interesting. Okay. Let's just really speed things up, I guess. 
Plus five range. Mm. Yeah, that's really increase. Okay. Honestly, let's just put um. Okay. Let's just put him here. Give him that, 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 and that. Pretty much gonna melt the room. So more DOT damage. Yeah. More range, okay. I'm really not worried with how fast this guy's melting through them. Okay, as as I'm um, starting to now lose, okay. Maybe I should have been a little bit more worried. Really just increase their DOT. Okay, let's put let's put this guy here. Why not? That's actually pretty cool. Now look at that. Maybe I should increase his fire rate instead. Let's slow things down a little bit. Let's take out that and let's give him more attack speed. And then we can give this guy like this. Okay. Things aren't things aren't looking too hot right now. Things are looking a little bleak. Yeah, these guys are so strong. My gosh, yeah, we're dead. We're dead. But holy crap. Do we have any like oh we do. Ah okay. Image tower experience. Okay. Toy space. Tower cost. Uh can I like get okay reduce? Oh no, I don't want to do that. Let's just go with that. Okay. Do we'll do like one more run, I think. How long did the first one run take? Eh maybe maybe we might get a, two more runs. Probably just one, though. Um uh, Ooh, we got another tower. Oh, and we got, uh, critical damage. Oh, okay. Huh. 
啊。Just you didn't fire. Oh, I forgot I have to do that. Why did he just do nothing last time? Do they need a crystal to be able to do something? I guess maybe they do. I was very confused by that. Okay. Oh, uh, can I replace him? Guess not. Okay. That's fine. Let's just put that guy there. Yeah, I guess they do need a crystal to actually be able to do something. Okay. Fair enough. I didn't realize that. I didn't realize that they actually needed a crystal. But they could at least survive without one. Okay. Let me just put down a bunch of those guys. What's his critical strike chance now? Now he's at a hundred percent. Okay. Go with that. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna just have a bunch of these guys down to kind of destroy anything that gets close. Okay, I forgot that they need- I keep forgetting these guys need crystals. Gosh dang it. Okay, well it looks like we're gonna actually be having more runs than I, uh, originally was planning for, because I keep being stupid. I literally talked about, like, oh yeah, this thing needs a, this thing needs a crystal before it can do anything. And then I forget to give it a crystal. Like, my gosh, I'm so dumb. Guys, destroying. Fire thrower tower? That's pretty cool. Increase. 
increase the range. Screw the DOT, let's just give him crit chance. Okay, now he's up to 100% crit chance. Expanding this area out more and more. Okay, I forgot to give this guy a crystal once again. I am I impressed myself with how often I managed to do this. Please, please, okay. Higher up to two. Reduce the cost, I guess. Earth crystal, frost crystal, fire crystal. I guess we're going for attack speed. Yeah, these runs uh, definitely have not been taking as long as I uh, expected them to take. Um, uh, Yeah, now he's up to 100% crit chance. Okay, I'll take it. That's the fire thrower, but that's fine. Take all that stuff off. Let's go to this guy instead. Why not? I feel like it would be better to have one kind of far away. So then you kind of deal with one side and then you deal with the second side so you're not having to deal with them at the same time. I feel like that makes sense to me. Fire tower would be better. Because obviously it's, a, it's like a consistent cone of damage. So that would do like good against groups of enemies. good maybe that'd be better not sure 
I guess I'm gonna keep kind of pushing that area back so they can deal with this, like this side first and then deal with that side. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Yeah, I'm thinking that the flamethrower tower might be better. A zombie horde? Ooh, that probably isn't good. Mm, yeah, I think from now on, I'm probably gonna use the flamethrower tower. I think that just kind of seems better. Uh... Go with that. Okay. Okay, I think we're in a good spot. Happy with this. That flamethrower is going to be doing a lot of damage. Eventually. For the time being, it's kind of slow. But yeah, extra flat damage. Oh. This just increases range. Let's go with that one next. Because why not? So after 240 kills, that's when it's going to be at the max. That's going to be pretty nice to have. Don't die. Okay. Don't come on. Ah, uh, dang. It's it. Lose all on taking damage or removing item from tower. Did I not lose it, though? Okay. Guess that didn't count. Fine with me. Yeah, that has to be okay. Oh yeah, we're dead here. Got two more from that, though. I'll take it. This is the fire crystal over here. Restored bullets. Uh, I'm not sure what that quite means. So, yeah, the frost crystal would be good to have. with that okay we'll do do one more this will be the last run flamethrower tower definitely seems like the better option Got some DOT on it as well now.
not sure what this is supposed to do. I'm not sure if it, if it eventually does something or... Got that thing. Okay, I'll take it, I guess. Jeez, yeah, the flamethrower is going insanely well. Honestly, while we're at it, let's just really buff it up. Oh, we get, what did we get? Strike chance is set. Ugh. So is it just like stuck at... At 15%? Is there no way to increase it? I guess we'll see. We'll find out. Oh, we got some free stuff from this, from this guy. Let's try another flamethrower tower. Because why not? Nice, we got the earth crystal now. Look at how many, this guy, 205 kills. Lightning Tower is doing pretty well too, though. Okay, every six seconds. All right, let's just keep expanding that part out then. Just so that they're only dealing with this area first. And then we can worry about the other areas later. Okay. I'm actually going to get rid of that for now.
Okay. Things are... Things are going well. Not saying that they'll keep going well, but currently they're going well. just seem really good. Because like their AoE is so huge. Increase the slow of, of him of the enemies using that guy. Oh, that one thing got destroyed, I think. Which is fine. Oh, things are things are not looking too hot right now, but Kind of have like I guess this guy has the debuff tower. Not saying that this plan is gonna work very well, but it might do something. Yeah. Oh, that was close. That was close. That was pretty good though. We made it quite far. We do oftentimes use the f the fire crystal. Uh, is it really? J I think it's just the frost crystal that I have as well. So let's let's go with that one. And uh, yeah, we'll we'll continue playing this in the next in uh, in another video. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Crystal Guardians. This is such a cool game, and this should if this is just the prologue. So if you guys want to check it out, like this is completely free because it's the prologue, obviously. Um, but yeah, it's out on Steam. I highly uh, highly recommend you guys go check it out. Um, and yeah, I can't wait for the full game to come out. It comes out on March 11th. So. I'll, have to, I'll definitely have to give it a try whenever it becomes available. So, yeah. Uh, I hope to see you guys in the next video. And, yeah, you guys take care.